a telecom scheme for spacecraft based on high-speed and low-speed hybrid TTNC system, presented by Zhao Siyang. Introduction With the continuous growth of the size of spacecraft software and the increasing demand for software on orbit dynamic loading and reconfiguration, it's more and more urgent to improve the high-speed uplink information transmission capability of spacecraft. The high-speed and low-speed hybrid TTNC system is a new TTNC system developed in recent years to meet the above needs. The low-speed and high-speed uplink channel of most existing spacecraft are com completely independent, and the data protocol, data flow, and the electrical device chosen are also different. This brings a lot of inconvenience to the uplink data processing on the ground and on board. By combining the data of high-speed and low-speed channel, the existing design of data flow is optimized. The data protocol is carefully selected and the cost of modification of existing software and electrical device are comprehensively considered. This new telecommand scheme can support the high-speed and low-speed hybrid TTNC system so as to adapt to the current and the future 5 to 10 years of intra-satellite communication and inter-satellite communication requirements. There are two main types of telecommand data, the direct command and the upload data. In recent years, on-orbit maintenance data and inter-satellite data have been added. Increasing demand for on-orbit maintenance and the reconfiguration of large-scale and, and super-large-scale software for spacecraft. Update of on-orbit intelligent processing-related algorithms applications. Increasing demand for autonomous constellation operation and large data interaction. The amount of single upload data increases from the kilobyte level to tens of megabyte level. CCSDS protocols currently are widely used in domestic TTNC systems and spacecraft, including TC synchronization and channel coding, TC space data link protocol, AOS space data link protocol, space package protocol, and so on. The com comparison uh, between OSI uh, layer and the CCSDS layer are shown as the following figure. <coughs> the TC transfer frame uh, is the typical data unit uh, of the data link. The virtual channel uh, package service in the CCSDS TC space data link protocol is usually used in the channel data link layer under the conventional TTNC system. It supports the transmission of one or more telecommand source packages that comply to the CCSDS based package uh, protocol in a variable length TC transfer frame with a maxim maximum length of 1024 bytes. The main aspect uh, to 
be considered in the TELIS uh, command scheme of the hybrid TTNC are as follow. The onboard data flow design should be adapted to uh, both the high speed and the low speed TTNC link. Considering the requirements of data encryption and decryption, uh, data storage, onboard data dis distribution, and uh, inter satellite data forwarding, barrel effect, barrel effect should be avoided to reduce the system application efficiency. Considering the high speed TTNC link can completely replace uh, the conventional low speed TTNC link to increase the redundancy of TTNC link. The design should consider the mature uh, scheme of the, of the existing uh, system and reduce the design overhead. <coughs> Through the conventional TTNC channel, the OBDH subsystem can handle all upload data. Through the high-speed TTNC channel, the OBDH uh, subsystem can handle all upload data except direct command. In the conventional low-speed TTNC link, the uplink TC transfer frame is sent to instruction module and uh, a processor module. The processor module handles up, upload data uh, or forwards it to other 1553 bus remote uh, terminals or send it to other mid-speed mid bus terminals via the data uh, multiplexer and uh, record module. In the high-speed TTNC link, the data uh, multiplexer and the record module stores on orbit maintenance data, enter satellite data, and the playback or, or forward them to mid speed bus terminals. It also playbacks the, store, the stored data uh, to the processor or forwarding them to 1553 bus remote terminals. The TC transfer uh, frame format of high-speed uh, TTNC channel can be selected as CCSDS TC space data link protocol combined with conventional TTNC channel. When data is sent to the OBDH processor, the, the virtual channel package service is used to transfer the TC space uh, packet and the if effective data field of the TC transfer frame becomes no longer than uh, 892 pro, uh, bytes. When data is sent is sent to data multiplexer and the record module of the OBDH, a virtual channel access service is used and the data field of TC transfer frame is fixed the length of uh, 892 bytes. Including a virtual channel data unit uh, that complied with the EOS space data link protocol. Include uh, TC space packages, IP packages, bitstream data, uh, user-defined data, and so on. Uh, about the, tele the new tele uh, command scheme, I have some further recommendation. First, the spacecraft identification of the TSA transfer frame and the, the VCDU should be the same, which represent the spacecraft receiving the, uplay, the, uh, the upload data. Second, 
the virtual channel identification of the TC transfer frame is used to indicate the direction of the data. Direct command, upload data sent to the OPDH computer software and upload data sent to the multiplexer and the record module. The virtual channel identification is used to, in, to indicate different data users. The value of the identification should be uniform, uh, specified with the VCDU of the data transmission channel. Third, for storing data that require, requires a sequence of data res recept, a zero start <coughs> sequential count is required at the VCDU counter. The data multiplexer and the record module of, OPD, of OPDH computer will, will store or forward the data frame only after it receives a frame that meets the ex accepted <coughs> count. Fourth, high speed and low speed channel can use the same data frame structure to share channel de decryption device. Fifth, the synchronization and the decoding module of high-speed and low-speed channel are, recom are recommended isolation to improve redundancy capability to system reliability. Six, instructions over high-speed channels execute immediately by OBDH computer software or other onboard 1553 bus uh, remote terminals. And the data rate of instructions should take into account the ability of the user to receive instructions. Uh, that's all my presentation, and uh, thank you for your patience. Thank you.